can we get anything in life? Even a disabled person. Man, one something. day, I'm going to have a brand new Cadillac. Not this piece of junk. I know you will. And one day, I'm going to have my own radio talk show called Big Boy's Neighborhood. Yeah. Man, that would be crazy if that happened. Not if. Big Boy's Neighborhood. When people are going to be asking me for my autograph, I'll be signing best wishes, Big Boy. Watch. Hey, I believe it. Oh, wait. Oh, speaking of the radio. Look at this. It's a Sony Walkman. It lets me listen to the radio from anywhere. Wow. That is amazing. I've always wanted one of these. Why don't you buy one? Sony. My mom says we don't have the money to afford. Mike. Why? Aren't you supposed to be working? This coach. What you doing just standing around? Yeah, no, I, I was yeah, just yeah, shopping. Yeah, yeah, just letting this loser make you lazy. Shut up, coach. Don't you got some work to do, boy? You're a loser. Just because I'm not working with my hands doesn't mean I'm not working. I just want to know. It's pretty clear you don't work with your hands. I mean, look mm. at you. You're some kid who will never be anything. What are you Leave on the... him alone, Frank. What's be on the radio, you, you Say turd. what you want, but it's not the truth. My mom says what I believe I can achieve, and I'm going to be the biggest voice on the radio. <laughs> Stop. You must got pick fat for brands if you think you're going to be anything in life. Pick fat? Give me these. You don't need to be eating anything. Why would you just... Stop letting this boy make you lazy. Get back to work. He is crisps. And one day, I'm going to let him have hey, it. don't pay attention to him, man. Come on, let's go. Should I take you to mom's house? Oh. I forgot you guys got evicted. It's fine, I'll just walk. Wait, no, no. Why don't you come in for dinner, man? And I'll drop you off after. My mom's making her chicken. I can't say no to that. Come on, come on. <laughs> You know what, this is fun already. You like that? <laughs> yes, sir. Uh. <laughs> well, Mike tells us that you want to be on the radio one day, Kirk. Wow, that'd be great if that happened. <laughs> it's not a matter of if, sir. It's only a matter of when. Well, I better get your autograph right now, <laughs> then. <laughs> Sounds well, good. Frank, <laughs> come on in. Come join us. I made your plate already. Thank you, sis, because I am really mm -hmm. hungry. Yo, yo, yo. You, what are you doing here? This is Kurt. Y'all know each other? He's going to be on the radio one day. <laughs> <laughs> No, no. Don't Just, believe a word is no, more saying. No, no, no. He ain't never gonna no. be. No! Don't say that. I believe in myself and my mom's. Uh, 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 uh. Shut up, bro. I hate to break it to you, boy, but your mama, she was lying. <laughs> she knows you ain't gonna be nothing but a big loser, too. Lay off the boy, Frank. Yeah, Frank, that ain't right. No, he needs to know this. Don't get upset, Speaking please. Speaking of your mama, boy. Stand she up. She don't feed you at home. Stand up to him. What you doing eating up all the our food? Kill him. Now stop picking on him. Mike's right. We invited him to dinner, so it's fine. Why don't you just sit down and enjoy your food, Frank? No, Frank. I'm serious. Speak up to him now. Your mama don't feed you at home, boy. Say he doesn't so. have a home, okay? Him and his mom just got evicted. What? What? Oh my gosh, really? Oh, Kurt, honey, I'm so sorry. Victor. <laughs> Big boy is also homeless? <laughs> and, and he wants to be on the radio? You can't be serious. <laughs> well, I... You mean to. Uh... Kurt, Mike. Sit down. I'm starving. Come on, let's eat. I think they're not hungry. Who are you? Kurt? Kurt? Baby, what's wrong? You seem upset. It's Mike's uncle. Oh. 
Since oh. I've never amounted to anything in life. You're his mom. Don't his... you waste your time listening to You're him? You're his mom. But what if he's right? What if I never make it on the radio? Hey. Gosh damn Listen it. Listen to me. Don't believe him. Baby, whatever you believe, you can. Not that again, mom. I mean, come on, look around. We're homeless. We're so broke that we can't even afford a Walkman. How am I supposed to be on the radio if I can't even listen to it? Child. What are you doing? Just come on over here. Come on. <clears throat> Now, I wasn't going to give you this until your birthday next week, but I guess you can have it now. Hmm. What is it? Just open it. All right, yeah. You got me a walk? But how? I thought we didn't exactly. have the money. So new. You don't worry about that. I made it happen. And besides, how in the world are you supposed to be on the radio if you can't even listen to it? <laughs> I can't believe this. Thank you, Ma. But, Ma, do you really think I'm gonna make it? Or are you just saying that to make me feel better? You Listen to me, baby. Do you believe that you can? Yeah. Can't say no. Well, then always remember this. What you believe, what you, you can achieve. Can achieve. This, I can promise you. And I want you to take this with you as a reminder. Any time that you need it, okay? I will. And if I ever succeed. When you succeed. Like you said before. When I succeed. I'm gonna buy you a house and you never have to be homeless again. Thank you, baby. I'm serious. Mm -hmm. We won't ever have to worry about being evicted or having the sheriff tell us to pack our things. I promise. And the money. I love you, baby. And I love you with everything in me. I love you too, Ma. Kurt is more inspired than ever to become the biggest voice on radio again. He uses his new Walkman to listen to the radio every chance he gets, imagining himself on air. Good. Even as he gets older, he never forgets about his dream. He gets a job as a bouncer so he can meet lots of new people. Yeah. Eventually, he meets the right person who happens to work at a radio station. He gives Kurt a chance to host a small nighttime talk show. Kurt couldn't believe he was finally going to be on the radio. The night of the show, Kurt's so excited to get started. That is, until people at the station stare and laugh at him. Why? They call him names. They write mean messages. And even tell him that he'll never make it long term on radio. Kurt was so upset. He leaves the show thinking he'll never work in radio again. But isn't the cast actually now? But then he runs into someone that would change his life forever. His friend? I don't know what I was thinking. What? Me have my own radio talk show? That ain't never gonna happen. What do you mean? You're good at it. Hey, watch it, man. My bad, man. Wait, big boy. No, why do you seem so upset? I mean, I'm fine, man. Come on, come on, wait, come on, man. Look. You can yeah. tell me. What's going on? I thought I could be on the radio, but the station practically laughed at me. Okay, so? Why are you so surprised? What do you mean? Man, man, look at you. Didn't I tell you you would never amount to anything in life? I mean, but hey, look at the bright side. At least you won't have to pay rent when you're homeless.
Maybe he's right. Maybe I'll never make it. Oh, man, my Walkman! Wait. What you believe, you can achieve. This, I can promise you. Wow. That's it. Get back up, I, I can't stop believing in myself. I came too far. I'm going to lose this weight, and I'm going to be the best radio DJ ever. Mm -hmm. Remembering his mom's words, Kurt gets more excited than ever to go after his dream again. He goes back to radio. And this time, when people make fun of him, he doesn't care. He never stops believing in himself. He keeps doing radio, and as time goes on, he becomes the number one radio yeah. host in Los Angeles with Big Boy's Neighborhood. He signs a major deal with the network and interviews some of the most famous celebrities in the world. He finally accomplishes his dream of becoming the biggest name in radio. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, big boy! We love your show. We even got your merch. Oh, that's amazing! Thank you. Nice I want to be just like you when I grow up, but I don't know. Everybody keeps saying that I'll never amount to anything in my life. You know, I feel you. I heard the same thing growing up, but I never let that stop me. By who? Your mom. Well, hello, big boy. Frank? Yeah, it's my grandson. Yeah. Turns out he's a big fan of yours. Look, uh... Now you apologize. I'm really sorry for the way that I treated you. I was wrong. But it turns out you really did make something of your life. Well, thank you, Frank, and I appreciate that, but... Actually, man, I should be thanking you. Thanking me? For what? All those things you said to me, Frank, all the negativity, the bad stuff that you would say about me, it's got me going. It made me work even harder, so it actually helped me succeed. I don't mind that. I love that, Mr. That big Boy. Do you think I could ever make it on radio? Cut, Big Boy? Let me ask you this. Big Boy is a Sunday? Do you believe you can? Well, yeah. Well, if you believe, you can achieve. Yes. And I know this because a wise woman told me so. You take that. Oh my God. Thank you. You keep that. And whenever you need a reminder, you pull that out and you just take a look at it. I'll never forget this. You'll be good, little soldier. Bye, Queen. All right, Frank. Yeah. Little soldier. Mom. Big boy, little soldier. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Hey, Mom. Now, I got a little surprise for you, all right? Okay. But you got to put this on. What? A oh, OK. Where are we going? You'll see. No. You'll see. Oh. <laughs> little bit more. Come. I got you. I got you. I got you. Okay. Right? OK. That's perfect. Child now you can take it off. OK. OK. The radio station is it over there? A house? Uh -huh. I don't understand. Is it for her? It's your house, Mama. It is. And it's paid for. So you never have to worry about somebody coming to evict you or where you're gonna live again. Oh, my God. Oh, baby, is this real? Girl, oh, my baby. Oh, I love you so much. I love you. I love you, too. Now, let me show you around. Oh, God, oh, oh, dear. <laughs> hey, Darman fam. I hope you love that message. I'm going to let my good friend... That, that's the end. Subscribe if it was all fun. Yeah, peace out.